Hi, Internet friends. It's Tim Schrock at Design Build Solutions, bringing you a quick bonus tip on invisible walls and trying to make uh, single line invisible walls. Let's get right into it. I've got this uh, model room. I'm working in Chief Architect Premier version X14 on a Windows 10 laptop computer. Um, by default, what I've set up here is, let's do this. So I've set up this room, and I'm going to draw a room divider. As a room divider, it is just a the room divider wall type is just insulation material with zero thickness, so it only has one line. But as soon as you change, say, the floor uh, structure to have a step, or maybe the ceiling steps up, um, let's do minus 7 there, this you cannot have a zero thickness wall type here. Uh, Chief just doesn't allow that for some reason. I can even go in here and try to switch to the um, room divider wall type back to that, and it just doesn't allow for that. So what you can do is let's define this wall type and call do a new wall uh, thin. Whoops thin wall, and let's just make that thickness, um, the thinnest it will go is 1 32nd of an inch. Let's, I'll just put in 1 128th and tab, and it'll make it zero. If I do 1 64th and tab, it just goes to 1 32nd of an inch. Then I'm going to click on back on here and change this layer uh, line style to a dashed line uh, to always be dashed and click OK. Now I get a single wall. It's technically a 32nd of an inch wide um, and still have that step in the uh, floor system. I'm turning on and off the line weights here so I can just kind of see and make sure it's not super, super thick. Um, if you want it thicker, <clears throat> we can certainly do that. Say that's uh, 35, like typical walls. There you get that. So you can make a, a very thin 1 32nd inch thick wall. You cannot use zero. Um, Chief will just automatically revert to the interior for uh, wall type. Hope that's helpful. Thanks so much for watching. Click like and subscribe. Follow along for more. Take care.